Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, so one of the most important things that you put into a rainwater harvesting system is called a quiet inlet. And so what we're gonna do right now is we're going to build a downcomer, which I'm gonna show you in a second. And then on that downcomer, we're going to fit this 90 and 45 in. And when we put them together, then when water comes into the tank, it's not gonna stir up the sludge layer on the bottom. The sludge layer is an incredible uh, bioremediation tool. It's part of the treatment train in a rainwater harvesting system and over time it will accumulate uh, any toxins or heavy metals or things that we don't want in our rainwater. And so this makes sure that when the new rainwater comes into the tank that it's not going to stir up the bottom um, and suspend all of that sludge on the bottom. So the downcomer basically allows the water to get close to the bottom of the tank and then this thing is what releases the water back up into the water column without disturbing the sludge. So here's the downcomer. Okay, so this is gonna come from the top of the tank. And then at the bottom of the downcomer, we're gonna stick this guy on right here, which is what's gonna allow the water to kick back up and not disturb the sludge layer on the very bottom of the tank. So you want to make sure your PVC is clean when you're gluing all this stuff together. Sometimes I'll even sand it if it's really dirty. So the first thing we're going to do is get some PVC glue. Then we're going to put in the nipple. And then we're going to put in the 45. And there we go. In this photo, you can see the downcomers going all the way down to the bottom of the tank. And then as soon as they get down there, they are sitting just slightly above the bottom of the tank. This is so that they don't sit in the sludge layer. The upturn ends of the pipe, however, are just below the minimum level in the tank so that when rain comes in, there's always going to be a minimum layer of water in the bottom. Water, when it crashes into itself, de-energizes itself quite rapidly. And so these downcomers with the flipped ends are going to ensure that we get the least amount of sludge suspension in the bottom of the so these downcomers are going to ensure that we get the least amount of sludge disturbance in the bottom of the tank this sludge as mentioned earlier is super important for the remediation and cleaning of the rainwater it's one of the most important barriers in a rainwater harvesting system if you're interested in learning more about this research i'll leave a link to some of the research that dr peter coombs and some of his graduates have done over the years on both biofilms and sludge layers and i think you'll find it really interesting so check the show notes below hey guys if you found this interesting make sure you hit the subscribe button give me a like it helps the channel to track and we'll see you in the next video